All right, guys, so we made it to Target here. It's just one by right by my house. It's pretty stocked, but nothing good. Uh, got some leaf here, which is a no bueno, but no basketball. As you can see, high demand cards are at the service desk now. So it gives everyone an equal opportunity to at least get some cards. But according to the checkup at the counter, Dude came yesterday, so no mosaic football or anything like that. And let's see what they got in the back here. Same thing in the back. There used to be sports cards back here, uh, but they've since changed it to Pokemon. There's nothing back here. However, on this little end cap here, they have some sports cards too, but this is the real plug that I just spotted. So if anyone's interested in these, they now sell these at Target. So we got a 500 pack of penny sleeves and six bucks. So. This is going to be a success in my book. I'm going to take two of these and call it a day. So no cards, but definitely still successful on the card sleeves. Thousand pack, thousand cards, uh, penny sleeves, 12 bucks. I'll take them. Salute to hoops, guys. Welcome back to the channel. If it's your first time here, welcome. Another day, another video, guys. Lakers and Heat are playing game five tonight, so by the time this video is posted, we're probably going to have an NBA champion uh, in LeBron James. I'm just making the assumption, um, but the, the, the Lakers are looking like a better team right now. So uh, before we get into today's video, like and subscribe, guys. Almost at 100 subs. We are at 98 as of right now. The current video, we are at 98 subs. If we can get to that 100 mark by the end of the month, we'll see if we can do it. That'd be pretty sweet. So, um, Moving on, uh, today I went to the hobby shop. Um, as you saw in the beginning of the video, we made a little Target trip too. Uh, didn't find any cards, but we did find those penny sleeves. Uh, which are uh, clutch, the 500 pack of penny sleeves at Target for $6. If you don't know, now you do know. Uh, it's, we all know that those are pretty clutch in this hobby. So if only they sold top loaders, then we would really be in business. Uh, today, after Target, I went to the hobby shop, picked up some more of these Absolute Gravity Packs. Uh, these were 5 bucks a pop. And I decided to pick up 12 of them this time, guys. So... I had a little in-store credit also, so it didn't cost me too much. Um, about 50 bucks for the 12 of these, somewhere around there. Um, so, not too bad, not too bad. Um, and I, I really liked the, this product last time we opened it. Uh, and they had a bunch there, so I figured why not. Uh, retail basketball seems to be completely dried up. I haven't seen any illusions. Uh, in quite a while or Chronicles either so uh, I'm guessing it might be done um, but we shall see it seems like Mosaic football kind of is taking over for the time being so we got Lori Markinen joining us today um, a lot of my cards are packed up I'm, I'm making a move uh, so I know you guys have seen him before so he's gonna join us on this break as well so we're gonna rip all 12 today and see what we can get so if you guys watched the last video we did get some some decent rookies out of this so hopefully uh hopefully we can get the same thing going here we got kyle lowry eric Pashal, Jarrett culver kyrie irving and then jonas valanchunas i feel like i pulled eric Pashal the first time too uh brandon clark nice little rookie there we'll separate the rookies uh goga Never seen that guy play before. LeBron, nice. And Steph Curry. Uh, 
Moving on here. All right, we got Kemba Walker, Grant Williams, John Morant, insert, Jackson Hayes, and Secret and Boyer. Damn, that was full of rookies right there. This absolute memorabilia stuff. Uh, I said it the first time when I opened it. Um, I think I like it better than hoops. It just looks, it's simple, but has a smooth little little look to it. So another Secret and Boya, Jarrett Culver rookie. Dennis Smith Jr. All right, let's see what we got here. Romeo Langford, he always seems to pop up somewhere. Cameron Johnson, Darius Garland insert, Russell Westbrook, and Mike Conley. This next pack here. Jimmy Butler, Casey Okpala, Cam Reddish, inserts Jamal Murray and DeMarcus Cousins haven't seen him play in quite a while uh, the guy just can't seem to be healthy so I'm not even sure I think is he on the Lakers now or I don't even know what team he's on anymore really but well, let's see if he can bounce back Carl Anthony Towns Rudy Gobert Cam Johnson Nikhil Alexander Walker and then a Giannis all right, come on, let's get some big names going here. These aren't doing it as uh, doing us as well as the last ones, that's for sure. Darius Baisley, uh, and I'm a fan of Darius Baisley for sure. Trey Young, Grant Williams, Ben Simmons, and Nikola Jokic. All right. Four more packs. Come on, let's get something good here. Let's see some Kobe White or some Zion or something. If I can get this open. There we go. All right, Paul George. DeMar DeRozan. Tyler Hero, nice. Another Jalen and Noel. And Dylan Windler, good Lord. We're getting, we are literally getting like every rookie in this class minus any uh, Notable ones. All right, Quindary Witherspoon, Chris Middleton, Romeo Langford, awesome. Darius Garland and Carson Edwards. Good lord. Okay, something's got to give here. Julius Randle. Kawhi Leonard, Jordan Pooley, Ty Jerome, Pascal Siakam. Weesh. All right. Kevin Durant, Keldon Johnson, PJ Washington, Lori Markinen, and DeAndre Aiden. Okay. All right, so let's kind of go over the hits. Not as many as last time. That is definitely for sure. A lot of rookies in here, but man, they are some some kind of low-level rookies. As far as our better ones go, I mean, we only got three here. We got Cam Reddish, we got a John Morant insert, and then the, just the Brandon Clark. Uh, the stack of rookies is probably is equivalent to the stack of base, which is, I guess, nice to see. Um, but then, once again, like we just got just some like we had Tyler Hero but just kind of some class B lower level rookies in this class it seems like uh, we just got like lottery picks and low in 20s and 30s so not what I wanted at all I did not have the luck of the draw on this one guys so that concludes this video guys just a short little video for you featuring the absolute memorabilia collection uh if you guys haven't watched the first video um featuring this that i did uh take a watch um it's definitely we definitely got a lot more hits in that in that one than we did in this one and we had less packs too which is crazy uh but that's just how the the dice rolls sometimes uh hope you guys like the beginning of the video too i know a lot of people probably didn't know target sold supplies so if you didn't get anything out of this rip <laughs> 
at least now you know you can go to Target and get some penny sleeves uh, for super cheap. So I guess something good came out of the video. Um, but I do appreciate you guys watching. Definitely more videos to come. I'm trying to keep the hobby alive and fun, guys. And um, I will definitely have a video out shortly again. Some investment videos, so on and so forth. I love doing this, so um, you guys love watching it, hopefully, and I like making them. So once again, thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you next time. Appreciate it very much.